An object may have several different forces acting on it, which can have different strengths and directions, but they can be added together to give a resultant force. This is the single force that has the same effect on the object as all the individual forces acting together. For example, a rocket travelling into space with a thrust of a thousand newtons and a weight of 200 newtons will begin to accelerate because the resultant force is 800 newtons. When all forces are balanced, the resultant force is zero. In this case, a stationary object remains stationary, and a moving object keeps on moving at the same speed and in the same direction. For example, in a tug-of-war competition, the resultant force in a stalemate is zero, because both teams are pulling on the rope with equal force. However, when a skydiver jumps out of a plane, his weight is greater than the air resistance at first, and he starts to accelerate. He then reaches a point where his weight and air resistance balance out. This is called terminal velocity, and the resultant force is zero. But don't worry, he's not stationary, of course. He's just plummeting to the ground at a constant speed, that's all.